Boys and girls, hello and welcome. Today, we're going to be testing the loot from 500 Alpha Rexes. Now, the reason I'm doing this test is because I tried to look up the loot from different types of Alphas and I couldn't find anything solid, no solid evidence. So, I thought, we'll try and get that evidence ourselves. Now, I've already done Alpha Raptors and Alpha Carnos, so if you want to see what we got from them, be sure to check them out on my channel. So I'm just going to give you guys a little example. So, I'm going to be spawning in these Rexes 50 at a time. I'm going to spawn them 50 at a time because, one... I could always get slot capped if I spawned in too many. And two, it likes to uh, make the game a little bit buggy and I don't want to crash my game. So this is our death pen. We started off small for the Alpha Raptors. We had to extend it a little bit for the Carnos. And I'm thinking once we get 50 Rexes in here, we're going to have to extend it again. But we're going to try it out to start with. So I'll just give you guys a little example. We'll turn the power on. These turrets are going to kill these Rexes. Oh my God, they're strong. Now, because we're in range of them, they're going to put their stuff in our inventory. So you get two uh, Alpha T-Rex teeth per kill. So we're looking for 100 every time we spawn them in. And it's going to be put in the loot in our inventory. And we're going to go from there. Uh, guys, so <laughs> this should be 50 in here. Um, now I'm going to have to speed this up because this is going to take these guys a while to die. I should really make this pen bigger, but we'll see how it goes in the first go. So round one. Alright, so I've learned a little something from that test. We get slot capped on 50, so I'm going to have to spoil in less than this, unfortunately. Um, it's probably a good thing because this is just absolutely manic. So what I'll do is I'll spawn in 25 at a time. And uh, we'll see if that goes better. I might also make them decompose quicker. That would be a better idea, I think. Okay, test to start again, guys. So I've dropped all them things. We're going to go 25 at a time. This should be a little bit more bearable. Alright, so we've got 50 teeth, so that was 25. Start storing these away until the end. Alrighty, round two. That one went a little bit better. So these tech turrets were doing their jobs, and although I happened to restock them almost every single round, the loot was starting to pile up. We smashed through number 10, then number 15, 16 and 17 all right guys we're on the last 25 now this should make it up to 500 I also didn't wait for the dead to clear so this is going to take a little while Oh, that took some time, but we've got the last 25. So what I'm going to do now, guys, because everything's just stored in these replicators at the moment, I'm going to separate them all into their own category. You boys good? I'm going to separate them all into their own category, and I'll be back once we've sorted it out. Right, we're back. Everything is out of these replicators and ordered, ordered into the vaults, guys. So just to show you, we have six, four, we have a thousand... T-Rex teeth, oh, you get two per kill, so that's 500. Now, you get 200% drops, you get an Alpha Rex trophy, and you get a Trike Bone Helmet. You also have a small percent chance, about 10% chance of getting a Rex Bone Helmet skin. So, let's just show you what they look like quick. So, this is by far the coolest helmet out of the Alphas. This is our Trike one. Looks pretty sick. And this is our X1. Not quite as cool, but you know, does the job. 
You can also, with this Rex trophy, mount it on a trophy wall mount. Guys, big boy. Now that is actually quite cool. Let's say that is 100% of the time. So that's probably the uh, coolest thing you're going to get from these guys. So if we start all the way down here. Now, Raptors gave us Cloth and Hide. Carnos gave us Hide and then Chitin. So you'd expect Rexes, for the difficulty they are to kill, to give you maybe Chitin and Metal. No. The same old Hide and Chitin. So we start in the Hide. No Ascendant Hide. We've got some Mastercraft bits. Not bad stuff, but not much of it, you might notice. A bit more journeyman, but nothing crazy. When we go on to Chitin, we have one Ascendant piece, and they're quite good boots to be fair for Chitin, don't get me wrong. A few more Mastercraft bits, uh, not bad durability for Chitin, I guess, some of them. Uh, but they're, they're nothing great for how difficult uh, Rex is. Load more journeyman. On to the bows. Two Ascendant ones, that's a really good crossbow, don't get me wrong. That is really good. But these guys are hard to kill. Like, you would have thought you'd have got some better stuff than this, really. A few 200% bits in there. On to pickaxes. One ascended thing again. Get a very good pickaxe. Another very good pickaxe there. One ascendant hatchet. 206%. Anything better than that? 211% there. All good stuff. <laughs> I mean, I'd expect it better to be honest. A couple of Mastercraft pistols. It's only what you're going to be getting from the Carnos and the Raptors. And we seem to be getting less of it. The, the, the numbers are going down. Pikes, not many at all. One Mastercraft, 191, 190 damage there. Nothing crazy. Arrows, dropped again, not as many arrows. You get all your berries as you normally do. Up here, we've got all our recipes as normal. And that is it. I'm gonna roll off some statistics for you now. So from 500 Alpha Rexes, they have a 30.4% chance of dropping a high piece, 33.6% chance of dropping something chitin, 55.6% chance of bows, 24.6% chance of pickaxes, 25.4% chance of hatchets, 6.2% of pistols, and a 4.6% chance of pikes. So what does this information tell us? Well, for how difficult Alpha Rexes are to kill, their loot definitely does not make up for it. When compared to Alpha Raptors and Alpha Carnos, these guys actually have a much worse spawn rate for everything. And that's a real shame, I would love to have seen higher tier things like fabricated pistols and shotguns come from Alpha Rexes, but they don't seem to do that. If you haven't seen my videos on loot from 500 Alpha Raptors or Carnos guys, I highly recommend you go check them out, they're on my channel, and they're pretty interesting. I really hope you've enjoyed this video guys, and I hope that now if you see an Alpha Rex, unless you're pretty damn well equipped, you'll just leave it alone. Thanks a lot for watching guys, and I'll see you in the next one.